Hello, in this tutorial I will show how to merge a database for identification cards in Corel Draw. First off, let's prepare a database in Excel. This database looks good and properly prepared. Each person is in their own row and information is correctly placed in columns. The only thing that needs to be adjusted is the image column. Corel requires a full path to an image in order for it to work properly. For this reason, I need to copy the full path of an image location. To make this easier, I will create a new column and name it apostrophe at image path. I've added an apostrophe and an at symbol before the name so that the Corel knows that this column contains the path of an image. In the fields below, I will write an easy formula, but before we do that, let's copy the path to an image. I will do this in Explorer. Okay, now I can write the formula. Equal, quotation mark, paste path and add a backslash, quotation mark, and symbol, cell of the image name, which is I2 followed by and symbol quotation mark dot jpeg quotation mark and enter. Then just drag the cells to the bottom and save the database in CSV format. Now in Corel I can link the columns to my fields on the design. In File, Print Merge, Create Load Print Merge, Import Data Source and select the recently saved CSV database. If the database was correctly saved, it should look something like this, except the row 9. I have a missing image indicated by an X. This is carmendo.jpg, which has a different file name as it should be. The quickest way is just to rename this file and press refresh in Corel. Now that X is gone, I can continue. From the print merge window, I can select text, images, or QR codes. And below that, I can select columns from the database. Let's start with the company name. I will select text and from data source columns select the correct column and press the insert field. Now I will do the same for the rest of the text. And for group section I can add just a number. For QR codes, it is the same process. Click on the QR code, select the contact from the type options, and press insert field. Scale the code to the correct dimension. Fill in the fields. And press update fields. Lastly, I need to add an image into the circle. For that, I need to select an image option, select the image path column, and select a placeholder image, which serves as a reference. Click insert field and place it on the design. Since my image is in square and I need it to be in a circle, I will put this image inside the power clip. Edit the power clip and rescale the image. And when done, press finish. Save the document and now all that is left is to press create merge document. Hope that this helped.